Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's a girl Pina back with another banger. So today, guys, I'm not alone. I'm with my friend. Hi guys, my name is Ola Mukhenge. So guys, in today's video, we're gonna be like, um, as you can see, guys, we're wearing scrub as health science students. <laughs> guys, please respect us. Um, so in today's video, we're gonna be like talking about our experiences. So I actually have like few notes. Um, so we're gonna talk about how we got in our first day experiences and challenges that we faced, second day experiences and also the challenges that we faced. And we're gonna compare the two. And yeah, we'll see as the video is like um, moving forward. So. Yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I've been giving you guys vlogs. Vlogs, it's been vlogs, it's been vlogs. So I'm giving you something a little bit different, man. Ne? I get So we have having McDonald's. Are you promoting the sale? Are you promoting the sale? I'm McDonald's. So um, I think you're going to start. Um, maybe uh, just say what are you studying and like how you got in the challenges you faced when you are no not applying but like even applying. trying to find a space. No? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hi guys. As I said, my name is Oli Mukheng and I am currently studying biomedical sciences. We are seeing biomedical sciences. That's really Period. Good. <laughs> Period. And to be honest. This was the list of the things that I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. It was not the first thing that I wanted to do. I know. When we were in high school. I didn't even know you were going, you were applying for <laughs> biomedicine. For biomed. Guys. Because the first the first thing that I wanted to do was to do medicine. If not medicine, I wanted to do something at pharmacy or whatever. Mm -hmm. But life happened after my You know, but in life after my <laughs> Life happened and I applied. To do, like, to accept any information. Indeed, I applied and I didn't get in for whatever that I was supposed to be studying for, which was medicine. And at that time, I was like, you know what? Yo, life, yo, my gosh, I wanna cry, I wanna die. I'm not going to school. I can see people already accepted, they're going to school. Uh, depression 101. <laughs> depression 101. <laughs> I'm like, what is happening? You know, all the stress and all those things. Then I applied to the institution that I'm currently in now. Uh, and I applied for biomed. I was like, this is my last chance. If they don't take me, then I don't know. Then I wake up. My mom's like, actually, take your bag. You're going somewhere. And I'm like, going where? The first day of your life. Yeah. Okay, I was like, you're going where? I'm getting in a car. My parents are like, actually, um... Uh, they've accepted you wherever we're going, so we have to go sign things because we have to go there physically and then we have to get your student card. And I'm like, God, is that you? Right, God, is that you? Then, yeah, I think the most challenging part when I was applying, it was when I was applying, I didn't have any challenges. The only stress came when the results came out and acceptance mm -hmm. letters were coming in. All I was getting was actually the space, actually, actually. I was running around into uh, offices, getting in and out, but it was not help. Then yeah. I think the only thing that comforted me was that sometimes we plan and God decides. Because if I yes. wanted to do medicine, who knows that I would have taken it for granted by now. Maybe I had to start yeah. somewhere, build the foundation, and get into medicine. And then, yeah, man. And you? Okay, so guys, um, <clears throat> with me... Um, so ever since from grade 11, 10, 11, I think, because one thing about us, we, we've been like planning our like journey since like great, since, I don't know, since like, literally before we chose even the subject. Mm -hmm. Like ever since we started our science, right? Like actually. Mm -hmm. So. I think ever since then, like I was like I wanted to do medicine, to study medicine. Where I don't know, I just wanted to study medicine. Um, grade eleven, I was like I'm studying. I'm gonna go for medicine because in grade eleven, I remember I was doing 
good ne so okay but then when i go to grade 12 you know all the to guys more more he wanna hurry okay medicine they want to say oh i wanna to more more all the to a born a hurry okay the requirements like to study um for medicine it's this and this and this and you know you know yourself you, i i knew i'm a hard worker i knew i was a hard worker back in high school but like i know that i'm wondering if you come with them so i had to consider other options okay? so if i in grade 11 i applied at vets i applied like at many universities but obviously i considered like vet um uct vets uct yeah, that's UCT and I applied at other universities, but I didn't really, I was like, I'm just applying. So, uh, I applied, at VETS I applied for uh, medicine, occupied, Bachelor of Science in Occupational Therapy and King, Biomedical Engineering. Yeah, and at UCT I applied for Physiotherapy uh, and Medicine. Fine. When I got to grade 12, I made a decision that I'm, I'm going to go for physiotherapy at UCT. Guys, I always tell people this story that I was so ready to go to UCT. I even applied for like accommodation at UCT, I remember. Guys, any metric results? Any metric results? Guys, I'm at UCT. UCT, any metric I like I remember I told my father what I really have to book like for flight because I'm ready I'm leaving Naka Cape Town no guys I would must have a grab Cape Town here away so Cape Town here guy when you have a content creator more ah eh this thing more so and then they rejected my um, application at UCT for both physiotherapy and medicine. Although I was meeting the requirements for physiotherapy, but competition, I cannot write in Makwani. Motu apply for physiotherapy, Maro, or not APS Koya, I go demo. What are you going for physiotherapy? What are you going physiotherapy? Requirement high in 40 plus. APS, APS. Okay, they rejected me ka medicine and biomedical engineering and they accepted me ka bachelor of science in occupational therapy. I didn't even know what occupational therapy. I didn't even like negative negative interest they are OT like guys, negative interest. I was waiting for UCT to respond to me. Sadly, they rejected me and I like um they also accepted me go University of Nelson Mandela, go PE, I think, for engineering. I was like, Nina. Engineering, Nina. Oh. I was like, okay, let me just go to VETS because VETS is like, it's one of the the best universities. And like, I, it, for me, it was either VETS or UCT. So I was like, VETS, yeah, let, let me just go to VETS. Although, although I went to VETS not knowing what is occupational therapy, guys. I tried to search. I didn't even understand what occupational therapy i tried to search like to search about it and like try to understand what like it's about but i couldn't really understand what occupational therapy i went and i accepted the offer without even understanding anything so yeah maybe i'll probably make a video at some point explaining to you guys what's ot but now for now let's stick to what we wrote down here and yeah that's how i got to this that's how i like i got into this and yeah and how was your first year experience no okay i think first year for me a lot of things happened apart from actually school mm -hmm. but actually transitioning from being from home and being useful being like used to things 
happening my own way. My mother is cooking for me. My dad is taking me to school. Mm. I know that I'm going to school for this certain few hours. Now I have to come back to varsity. I have to stay with the random strangers that I don't know. I have to cook for myself. Every day comes like a decide coach. I have to wake up myself. So the transitioning was actually uh, a bit difficult. But then also it was kind of a bad and a good thing for me because the other part is that I actually knew that being independent doesn't actually require someone to monitor you or doesn't actually require someone to mentor you. Yeah. You just wake up and automatically you know that tanto to hika sexy, tanto week your breakfast, you have to make your own bed, you have to make sure that you attend all your classes. Because at least when you knew at least when you were like at that time you were responsible. Like you were able to cook for yourself. Able to like you were like mm show me. Make it in mm na some of my kids still look quite high. So I was just like, it's a lot. And then uh, I remember my mom put this there multiple times. Or am I sure that I'm gonna share with people? Mm -hmm. Am I sure if I give it to my camera studio, stay alone, and whatever? Yeah. Me being me, I was like, no, I want to be like other kids. I want to share, I want to meet people, I want to get out of my comfort zone. You know, I mean, I've always had. Friends, my little girl, when I go high school, they were always my friends. I used to live at the second year old, so now I have to go make new friends. Yo, hi there. We got. Yo, we got. We turn into oh, we should move in here like this. Yo, so a lot of things came in my mind. I was like, you know what? I don't know, but I have to do this. Then I moved in with my roommates. I was I was in a studio, uh, not a studio, a uh, thingy, a unit. I was about four. Then when I got there, and then when I went to the and then I was like, maybe it's just gonna be the two of us. Mm-hmm. What you say? We can never fail. Keep quiet. Every time you open, I tell you, Morolo, how you keep quiet. Keep quiet. But I'm trying to get you to move to one. Eh, you feel about saying, "Lako, I'm not one. I'm pale, I'm not blue. I'm pale, I'm not I'm too lonely. Someone else. Be who? Be who can understand? Yo, I'm not the man. I'm not the man. Eh. But then I started forming a relationship with Mona because they were a little bit older than me, I think one year older. Then I was like, okay, you know, we started to get to know each other, I formed a relationship, as in like we were living in a community, but in Nokar we are a family already, and that was good. And on the side of school, it was a little bit challenging from transitioning to plus nearly online learning. Yeah. Online learning. And three lecturer. Those people, yeah. it's not like it's mem mamang from high school on a route life science. I couldn't put over where now. What is this book? What is this book or whatever? Yo. So these ones, they don't care about you. You know, you're on your own, and it's mm -hmm. either you come out of your uh, comfort zone. You know, when I would see the question, when now you are so used to actually just staying behind, and then you won't know anything because they're not gonna read your mind. Who to go high school? Mm -hmm. Then I was like, you know what? Now it means I have to come out of my comfort zone. Now everybody has to keep quiet. What if the question like I had lately? <laughs> You know, then fine academics. Uh, for the first block, I was like, because now we're on a block system, we have for Rotana, each and every uh, the module take it and I do four modules for eight weeks. Mm -hmm. So now I'm like, textbook, Ekana, eight weeks. Mm -hmm. Barry, what, what, what is happening? I was so used to doing life as the whole year. Why? Why do I have to do it? Yeah, four, four modules. Um, and I was doing like four modules. Um, actually. <laughs> oh, as I was saying, I was doing four modules uh, for eight weeks and I had to like teach myself all these things because online learning to be honest guys those lectures never fit out any slides and then they just go back to whatever that they were okay. doing you know and then there's a test there's a quiz there's you know i was so not used to write homework and homework yeah page a one so yeah. now and also, 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 also
Fini pilo kopi za tori so ne kopi za tori. Nomo za straight di sa. Kere kopi si. Nomo za straight di sa raga yo za mai. To mai ke ba. So now it's all in my head. I have to do all those things. So I think that was the other challenging thing about um moving from high school coming to varsity and all those things the social life guys oh yeah. so that little munyeta oh it's like a moon clone she cool but what i'm going to make a open by her veil she cool but rooms are but rooms are you was somewhere somehow get on a rock or poison i'm a great way right we are literally going to group but i think also i'm grateful for that part of life because mm. i grew to a point where i had to teach myself that there's time to groove there's time to study there's time yeah. to play and there's time to study mm. guys you cannot study 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 for your whole life you cannot study 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 what's the board what's the like you and you cannot go for what's the board 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 what's the I was so grateful for that phase of my life and yeah. also reality of meeting people and having to let go of people. But she man about who's gala from varsity. So all those things they came as a package, you know. I wasn't ready for those. Yes, they sat me down and like, this is varsity. Like expect to grow niche. Ha ka 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 Yo, I think so. Indeed, varsity is not all good, all perfect, or whatever. Mm-hmm. But other men there, they're just hungry. They're just they're looking at you like, actually, the freshers. Who are you? We are here to hurt you. You know, all this transitioning from not being used to much of our campus is kind of holding hands and going back home. Now, I have to be in your face. I have mm-hmm. to be in your space. Some things get distraction because boyfriend they not want to do, not can study. Mm-hmm. You understand, but other than that, it was a good experience of first year. First year was very good. I was so excited. I Linda, I'm just like you. I didn't know what the hell was going on. I was like, I have medicine. Ding dong. I got to lab, but there's a pee pad. Get it? You. So, but it was good. It was good. So for me, first year was not in terms of um. friendship and like not being stressing about um I'm going to get there go bale man go bale man it was not uh, as bad because I was with this other former friend of mine and so we were like living in the same unit and like it was easy like we were always together to a point where we didn't even go out and more especially it was online so we didn't have to go to school we were just like studying you know on rooms and all that and socializing at campus was so was a bit of a challenge to me um uh, because i was only going to to school for ot like my for my major because we had like things like work workshop kind of like things like practicals so guys the way they get it desperate to na le tshon like they get it desperate to such a point in learning Like you, <laughs> like you know, 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 like you But then, like I was, to, like I was going to school and talking, being like able to form conversations with people. But her friendship, ella is strong, ella is forming. Never say me out. I'm sorry. And then I'm going to get desperate. So fine. But I knew people. <laughs> very talkative everyone new pressures <laughs> everyone on that group new pressures have a pressure some of all our with three question all our whole hacking about with a question guy to pressures come my five oi buti sa question and no boy buti sa i was like that like i was like yo 
so and then okay but then in terms of what uh academically i was okay okay i was academically i was doing i was doing physics chemistry uh apes uh sociology at some point physics but um, like I said, in Newton, so it's in Newton, so like a high school, little work energy and power projector and whatever. How we come on, I think. How we come on, Vasiti, Newton, so we'll find on now. I will tell Newton, say, and now I'm going to keep it. However, no, I will tell Newton, say, keep it. Or we'll have a young because Tommy, I remember in high school, I used to love work energy and power. Like, I, I used to. I hate that. I hate that. Yeah, I used to love work energy and power on physics. Varsity. Yambanta. Varsity is not a way. thing. Starting from chemistry. Applied chemistry from varsity. Chemistry. Like, chemistry was easy. Like, it was easy when you were studying chemistry. Test, quizzy. Test it. No class zero. Zero. Why grade at zero? No varsity. Zero. Yo. Yeah, that's true. And there was this, there was some point, ne? We were writing like the quiz, like each and every week, we were writing like quiz for chemistry and physics. Even the physics, get to me like physics. Chemistry, at least I was trying like, like half marks and stuff, and like all oh, getting a total more quiz though. Physics, like kind of zero of twenty. I was there was this other point, like it was like consecutively so zero of twenty. Karen, we don't know. Tom, 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 what? I was like, yo, and then. One thing about varsity, varsity is group work. Yeah. Ah, so I'm going to only one. We're going to only one. We're not going to talk to each other. We're not going to talk to each other. We're going to talk to each other. Varsity is group work, guys. Take that advice. Varsity is balance. You need people that are going to balance you. Varsity is group work. So, yeah. So I had to find friends. So I I made this one guy friend. I had like got a ticket. Let this one guy friend. He was smart. I was helping him with chemistry and he was helping with physics. Guys, I hope lecture and are too sana in terms of studying guys. I hope you then guys sharpo so we're helping each other in terms of studying guys man in terms of studying please so um yeah man and then uh I I one thing that I'll always be grateful for is that at the end of the year when we were writing exams blah 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 for chemistry like for chemistry I think I failed three tests and passed one test and I had to write the exam I also failed June exam I had to write um, when, when writing the final exam and then when my results came I got 50% on the dot oh. guys I got 50% on the dot by more chemistry and I was like I didn't even write the sub and I came to the, I was failing chemistry but I got 50% on the dot guys here I am I get here we can go first day can repeat that first day yeah. so I got 50% on the dot and, and like I passed it the year blah 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 proceeded to the next year she yeah, first year was not good. It was not bad. It was not bad. But it it was, was bad. It was bad. Yes, it was bad because it was it, like it was like our like first time experience in facility mm. and like yeah, how to manage studying, how to study. Because one thing I noticed, studying for high school things is not the same as studying for facility. For like studying for facility things. Okay, <laughs> I'm not into group assignments, I'm not into group work. Yeah, I don't like working with people. I don't like blah, 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 blah. Blah. Mm -hmm. Oh, failure. Medicine students were First year medicine students were crying right. about chemistry. Mm -hmm. uh, chemistry oh. was just something else. Chemistry is something yeah. else. Because I had because uh, each and every block I was doing four modules, so you can imagine in four blocks, mm -hmm. if it's four modules, I'm doing close to twelve modules or mm -hmm. sixteen modules a year. Mm -hmm. You understand? And I'm just like this chemistry one shop. Mm -hmm. Chemistry one in a textbook yet day. That's chemistry two. Yeah. And I'm like, how mm -hmm. Physics. 
I got physics at the last block. Hmm. Nekin kule ne, but out of everything, eki 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 rile. Kyo na ki pasiting like ki pasite. Ki kuna ki special for physics. Yeah. Kyo na ki. Burang yah. Na ko pala sa kahit na. Na ko pala sa kahit sorry ki kule distinction ni biyang ko physics. Yo. Ah, she. Vasit is another thing. Vasit oh yah ko alor na na nekto a student ko high school. Please don't come with that mentality. Don't come with that mentality, baby girl. Here we learn, we pass, mm. we study, we work. Varsity, you wanna pass varsity, you work hard. Work hard, like work just be a hard work hard. and don't like stream yourself. So this is what is so cool. If there's a year, I can, like an academic year, more plumber, guy, learning a skill level. There's health science, second year. Health science, second year. Okay. okay. Nekir lagi kamu lagi kira tu wela, kira kira something gila hat. Kira mana? Crying when you're studying, you crying when I I remember like I would cry before writing an exam because physiology. This other friend of mine, she was like, please just please don't start. Start home. Yo, I would like what yo guys physiology anatomy. Anatomy fine. Anatomy. From ish anatomy is fine. Physiology, guys. Physiology, physiology, guys. I I hate physiology with everything in me. I I I don't know, Sham. I hate physiology. I cannot feelings with everything in me. Second year was just bad for me. It was a horrible year. I've never experienced failure. I was failing like first. Like second year, guys, I was failing each and every test, physiology. Yeah. Oh, guys. No. Yeah. So, like, guys, it's not easy knowing that you've been passing from high school and then you get to varsity and then you fail. Hmm? It's not easy. It's something that, like, I don't wish anyone to go through. Exactly. Because, wow, what rough, guys, so tough, but it's life. We are on our own journey. It's my own journey. It's my own race, guys. I give more our competition. Even on the motor. So, yeah, man. Um. Uh. So, but but then, despite everything, Shem second year was nice in terms of like we were like we got to experience like um lab like practicals for anatomy dissections and stuff like that. That was the nice part. And for physiology, the physiology practicals and stuff like that, like didn't let go do this crap. Oh, so yeah, man. But there was a point in my life where I would feel like class, and I was doing also microbiology, histology, yeah. and all those things. Yeah, I was also doing like anatomy, so like cross and histology, and histology. Yeah. So at some point, so I was really intelligent. At some point, I was like, "Pila pila, this crap is getting deserved now because mm -hmm. it's not make sure. Mm -hmm. I is not make sure. I will go make sure. Hey, I'm like, unga steni kamu leben, unga steni kamu lecture mu kajwa kesa unga nix kudu loka nogo lelo paro ukaz. Kya kwa na something? Kya create fifteen percent? Like this was literally the first time in my life I remember getting up for sit down for sub. I don't know the sub. Kiri. Sub. Sub. Go go and take your waiting in Muri. Like you quite happy. So I guess Shem second year for me it was it was nice in terms of other things academically it was it was challenging. I fought for myself and it.